I don't know where is the problem then. Because I entered the correct score against you, and the Janamoin score has been fixed now. Oh, Sharian! Sharian entered the wrong one. That one I didn't pay attention to. There you go, there you go, no worries. Kalriel? You're up, buddy, you're up. How does your voice command stuff work in card games like Hearthstone, where the cards in your hand are kind of moved about as you get more cards in your hand? Well, if I want to select a card, I need to say a command for how many cards I have, and then a command for how, which card of the ones I have, I have, I want to select. So I wouldn't just say one, two, or three in case of this. I would say three one, three two, or three three, which would mean First card out of three, or second card out of three, or third card out of three. That's basically how it works. Beginning three. Beginning two. Beginning confirm. I'll keep that stuff. If nothing else is top decked, I still don't mind opening up with the stuff. We're moving ahead, Astral Storm, because Stone of Death is not here. But in case Stone of Death comes back, I am still not closing down his matches. Home. Home. Replace three. Cast one. Cast one. Finish turn. And what do you just steal my poor mana? Ah, it's a little sad the way I don't get any mana. But then I get to punch something. I get to punch a Crimson Oculus. Which is a pretty important thing to punch. Because it grows as I summon things. Oh, fuck that! Fuck that. I guess I don't get to punch him. I need to silence him. No way around it. Really. Because I need my Star's Fury. Replace four. Obelisk is too slow right now, can't use it. This is this is too weak. Um, now I'm already getting wrecked in the early game here. Um, the only way I get out of this is by Star Fury, but I need to silence him. Um, otherwise he gets too big. Cast three. What the fuck is this deck anyway? This is like an anti-Vitruvian deck. He's basically picked Songhai and just playing anti-Vitruvian. Cast one. He beat Janamoin. Why wouldn't he beat me then, I suppose? 2-0 as well. We'll see. Strike four. 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 What the fuck game? Just click it! You... I'm gonna flip the fuck out here. I've been saying strike four for the last minute. What is happening with voice attack today? Man, it's... It's so frustrating what is happening to voice attack right now. It's as if your ha For me, it's as if your hand suddenly stopped doing what you tell it to do. It's like you wanna, you wanna m grab the mouse with your hand, and it grabs your fucking ear all the time. That's the, that's what's happening, that's what I'm experiencing right now, as voice attack is, is messing up for me. Oh my god. It's fucked up. And I'm losing horribly. <sighs> Replace three. The obelisk is too slow, I cannot play it. 
This is useless. The the silence against him. There's nothing I can really do here. Just another Star's Fury and keep losing HP until I lose the game. Yeah, I, I don't see anything else I can do. I mean, what, I, I drop a Silver Trace and then it's just gonna die for free? I'm gonna drop myself in a, into a corner that he will get to... Shit, I guess the alternative would be to keep losing HP. Cast 4. Oh. I need to somehow figure out a way to win maybe later, I don't know. I don't even know anymore. I don't think I can win this. Finish turn. Not with the top deck of this fucking quality. This is not a very good tournament for me, let's just say. Getting wrecked with, with my top decks. And I need to restart my duelist. These sounds lagging around. Yeah, he's playing Songhai, what can I say? He can just teleport his minions next to me. No problem. No problem. So now I'm gonna have 9 HP and he's still at 25. I've seen that happen many times when I had 25 HP and the enemy was dying. I know, I know how that looks, and it's not looking like victory, let's be honest. Cast 3. Cast 1. Um. Click. Cast 2. Cast two. Oh. Strike four. Strike four. Oh. Oh. Strike four. Oh. Strike four. Oh. Oh. Finish turn. Not very good. A couple of spells and I'm gone. And no Aymara to recover my HP. I'll need to basically top deck Aymara. And he needs to not have the Onyx Bear Seal. Otherwise, he is just going to top deck spells until I die. And I will not kill him fast enough. He's just going to kill me with top decked spells before I can kill him in any other way than Aymara. Aymara is the only, is the only hope. Let's we'll see, maybe he's got, top, he's got lethal already with some kind of backstab mechanic. Nope, but Dancing Blades are pretty efficient. Mm. And he kills this before I can buff it. I guess I'm gonna need another Rasha's Curse Dunecaster combo to put something in between my hero and his. Replace one. Ah, that is interesting. Um. 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 What if I put that in between our heroes? Cast one. Um. 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 Finish turn. Let's see. Let's see the kind of answer he has. Because if he doesn't have an answer, things can really turn around here with my artifacts or having a big flying unit like that. We'll see. He needs to not have an answer though. Which is unlikely, but possible. Possible, possible. He's not even attacking it with the blades, which does indicate he's probably gonna have an answer. He's gonna surround me with minions then? So maybe instead of having an answer, he's just gonna drop so much shit on the board that I can't deal with it? Mm. 
Yeah, that's, that does seem that does seem to be the idea. Replace one. What do I get to work with? That's that's a decent thing to work with. Okay. I probably have to kill the 4-4 four four with with a Serex. Unless I kill the Chakri with a Serex, kill this thing with a summoned Rasha's curse. And then I can run my hero. Cast four. Um, I need to play my turn fast. Cast five. Um, because I'm still going to be top decking things. Strike eight. Um. Cast one. Cast... Hang on. An obelisk. Do I want an obelisk instead? I think I want an obelisk instead, yes. Cast one. No, no! Behind me! Fuck! No, behind me! Did I just kill myself? Did I just... Kill myself. Should have protected myself from backstab instead. But we'll see if it even matters. Phoenix Fire. I was kind of afraid of that. I wanted to buff him again just so he is out of Phoenix Fire range, but we'll see. He three damage and Oh fuck I just had two saber spines. Oh my god, if I buffed him twice instead I would have been fine. Oh my god. I would have been fine if I buffed him twice instead of greedying for the obelisk. Oh well, he could have had other answers as, as well. I mean, one spiral technique and I'm dead. A uh, assassin teleport activation and I'm dead. Hum. It was just just a very fucked up early game, and I almost came back. So, props to me, I guess. Hum. Hum. From almost coming back from an uh, impossible situation. Hum. If I buffed him twice, I wonder what would have happened. Yeah, let's just... Beginning one. Beginning two. Beginning three. Go first again with a shitty starting hand. Beginning confirm. I think I went first in like 80% of the matches today. It's so stupid. Um, replace one. Um, um, um. Cast one. At least I got a good replacement. Finish turn. You should get some science third, which they are amazing, at least in my deck. If you're playing Janks and, and Orb Weaver and things like that, then yes, but then you should play a Portal Guardian deck rather than my deck. My deck is a ranged deck, and maybe the third wish is not, it's not as good. Wait, he's playing nothing? Oh, damn. Oh, damn. Click. I'm tempted to waste my Dune Caster, but but play my my Pyromancer as well. I'm totally tempted, but no. Click. Cast two. Because if this Howler survives, I'm gonna have a really good next turn with this buff. Finish turn. And if not, I may still need that Dune Caster to combo with the Star's Fury. This is a decent opening. And he must have been must have had a really bad top deck too not play anything on the first turn while going second. That's That almost never happens, unless you've got a really risky deck. A really gimmicky deck. Okay, that and trade with a hero, and my Howler doesn't survive. Okay. I'll be I'll, I'll have to actually attack this Naga myself with the hero as well, if I want it dead. Unless I want to do the Star's Fury Dunecaster combo. I might actually want to do that. Nah, I want to drop a Scarab. Totally want to drop a Scarab instead. Um. 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 Cast 
cast still. Finish turn. Yeah, Portal Guardian deck absolutely sounds third, which is a must-have. But I, I rely less on having a massive number of minions. I think I should actually drop the uh, the Fireblaze Obelisks from my deck. They seem to be an antiquated thing that I don't use anymore. I just replace it all the time because it's too slow. It does synergize with my Stars Furies and stuff, but I seem to have been relying on the ranged portion of my deck much more and the and the meaty brawlers like Aymara. That that Obelisk seems too slow in the in the late game, and I can probably figure out a better three cost opener for the early game. I'll think about it, I'll think about it later. What could I put instead of the obelisk as a good opener? I didn't like the orb weavers that much. But shit, maybe. They're good for stealing a lot of mana. Sound is so bugged right now, I couldn't even hear it anymore. Wow. Okay, that is definitely a Star's Fury Dune Caster combo. Cast one. Or is it? I mean, they, they have 3 HP, which is very inconvenient for my Star's Fury. I may want to just instead drop the Dervish and the Dune Caster. Replace two. My god, it's buggy. Home. Home. Cast five. So much lag. Cast three. And spread it so that the mantis cannot hit more than more than two. Home. Home. Because it is a frenzy mantis. Home. Home. I'm gonna go into melee range like this. Finish turn. But I'm not gonna trade, because it's still, this is song high, I'm scared. I'm scared of trading. Without my artifact combo that I just got from my hand. Okay, this is this is much better top deck than I've had in the last three games. Maybe something can be made work here and we can go into a game three. Piercing Mantis? This one? Nah, no, it's in your deck, because you can buff it. I cannot buff it that much. So nah, nah, a two, a two damage frenzy. That um, I, I have my first wish for buff, but I'd need to add the third wish. I feel its strength is is coming up. I think only if you if you properly buff it as a two three for two. No melee is still good. Melee is still good for my deck. I'm not supposed to have a purely ranged deck like you, Astral Storm, on your Songhai. Because as you saw, uh, purely ranged decks fall flat on their face in this game. I, I, I may want to add Janks, but that's more expensive, and then my openings will become much less reliable. I mean, if this Mantis was dead, I guess, I guess it's just one hit. I can take it and still use my artifact combo on this line and just completely wreck him. Cast three. Cast five. Home. Home. Cast five. Yep, he knows what's coming. And it's not pleasant. Might have been lethal right there. Home. Home. Two. Okay, I need to restart this shit. No, no kidding. So, I'll be back in a second, but, but this thing needs to go and then start again, because it's way too laggy. I need to also look at the processes, maybe something is eating much more memory than it should. Some kind of memory leak somewhere. Firefox has a memory leak, it's just grabbing more and more memory as it keeps running. Some other programs as well, that I'm not running as well. But maybe when I closed my Dragon Dictation software, it's... It didn't close properly and kept eating memory on something like that. So I need to investigate what the hell is happening with my lags. And then we can resolve this epic best of three. 
Also, my stream is completely frozen. I can't even switch to a break screen properly. My goodness. My goodness. There you go. That's a break screen. And... Oh, okay. Okay. So, basically, there is a memory leak in OBS. OBS is now eating uh, 1.5 gigabytes of RAM memory. Oh, my fucking god. Still, I don't want to restart it. Restarting the stream is messy. Okay, maybe restarting the duelist will do for now. I don't know. But, man, I need to restart my computer every time I start streaming. That just needs to be a habit, a rule. Part of my everyday ritual. Otherwise, this shit is just not gonna fly. Maybe I'll restart the stream when there's gonna be a voting after the tournament for probably Age of Wonders, let's be honest. You guys enjoyed that campaign. You want to see what I can do when I'm trying really hard. We'll see. If it doesn't help, I will restart it right now, but... I will also, man, I'm already going so over budget in the last two months, it's ridiculous, but I keep, it, it, things keep popping up that I need to buy, I need to buy more RAM. I just need to buy more RAM, because I've got only six, and it's always been, you know, enough, until I started experiencing these gigantic memory leaks, with OBS suddenly taking 1.5 gigabytes of memory, then uh, Firefox taking like half a gigabyte, sometimes even a gigabyte. It's ridiculous, so one one way to do it would be to install a new stable Windows, I suppose, I don't know, or change my browser and shit. But another way to do it is just buy enough RAM that the memory leaks wouldn't, wouldn't affect me anyway, because I just have too much memory anyway. Well, the sound isn't lagging just yet, and I'm going second, and I got a blasting stuff, so... I, I will keep calling it Blasting Stuff, Blasting Ark, whatever. I, I'll never get it right. I've accepted that fight. I've made peace with it. Beginning three. Beginning two. Normally, I really like this buff, but I am scared that I will end up having no unit to buff. Beginning confirm. If I don't mulligan it. Now, I could just go grab my mana just so he doesn't steal it. I think I'm gonna do that. And then blast anyway. Actually, no, because I have to kill the Chakri Avatar. And so I need to go to the bottom. Home. Strike seven. Cast one. Cast one. Four eight. Four four. Finish turn. Replace two. Let's replace one. Finish turn. I will need something else. I will. Oh, nice. Okay, I got my artifact combo. The revenge from the Janamoin games <laughs> coming in. And he's gonna, if he wants my mana, he's gonna line up his units. So see, he's not grabbing that mana because he doesn't want to line up his units. Now here's the question, what do I do? Do I grab my stuff and blast this shit? Do I grab my stuff and blast him directly? Do I Star's Fury? If I start Sphere, there's no way I can get a double mana to also use the Dune Caster. There's no positioning that it would work out with. The mechanism for refreshing the artifacts? Mm, nah, nah, I don't think so. The Oculus could be an overall... Primus Fist... It's just like a third wish all over again. But maybe, maybe the Primus first, yeah. That could be good. Could be good. What the fuck do I want to do here? Well, replace this first of all. Okay. Mm. I'm pretty sure I just want to blast Kalreel in the, in the face. If this thing wants to trade with me... Finish turn. It's still a decent trade. Refreshing may work better in artifacts that you can control better, like 
Magmar's claws or Lionar's um, Lionar's regalia, but but these ranged artifacts, it seems it's it's a, it's a very volatile thing, uh, keeping them alive. Like you you are either very often with those ranged artifacts like that, you are either completely safe with those artifacts or they get bursted down so fast that no amount of extra durability can save you. Like, look at this. My artifacts are gone just like that. Just like that. Wait, why, why did they not lose durability? Is that some kind of bug? Oh, no, 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 it's just a uh, delay in animation. Of course, like, look at this. It's, it's not even fucking close. Like, there's no way that... Um, and it's not just like I'm throwing out an example that just popped out to to use on my for my advantage. No, it's it's very often the the, the way it, it works. I either am completely safe with my artifacts or I ca I can't use them at all. And now I fucking lose. I mean, what do I do now? Replace one. Maybe Aymara will still save me, but okay. This this is very helpful. Um. I don't think I care about the mana. I think I'd rather just trade with that 3-3 to protect my hero's HP. Cast 3. Oh. That was a nice top deck. Strike 3. I was in big trouble until that came. And then I'm on next turn, so I have a guaranteed good play. Finish turn. Not so bad. Wait, what did you misclick, Calreal? You didn't attack? Or, no, you added uh, three attack into something that in didn't utilize it. Oh yeah, that was pretty, pretty bad. Well, hopefully you can experience some of that beautiful divine salt that you have been enjoying me experiencing in the past, uh, in the past couple of games. You can, you can get your fair share of salt yourself, so that everyone will be taken care of in equal measure. I think it's only fair, after you enjoyed so much how I, been lo how I was losing and getting completely unlucky against Janamoin. Of course the UI could use a lot of work, as for some, it's still an alpha. It, the game is not even supposed to be a browser game, and it's working Chrome only. Of course it needs a lot of work. I mean, the, the stability alone that the game will gain from not being a browser game is just gigantic. Oh really? And then you trade against Minion? Well, I don't know about that move. Interesting, interesting. Um, I'm not sure. Um, um. Okay, but this is gonna be really nice. Um, um. And considering I'm playing Aymara right now, unless he's got the, the, the bear seal, cast 4, I'm gonna have a health advantage, a big one, cast 5. You sit down, bro. Finish turn. None of your shenanigans. So I'm most likely going to have a health advantage, so I can trade with him, I think. We'll see. I'll probably just become an owner of a really cute and sweet panda bear. But we'll see. Nah, if he had a panda bear seal, he would have already used it. He's thinking, which means he doesn't have the obvious answer. Spellbinder! Okay, so he doesn't have an answer, so he's just gonna drop something even fucking bigger. That's basically how he deals with it. Okay, do I have lethal? Because this is, uh, 5 plus 12. 5 plus 12, 17. No way, 17, son of a bitch! Oh wait, no, my spells are costing more. I don't have double Star's Fury, never mind, never mind. I'm not even close to lethal. Is he flying? He's not flying. It's okay. Unless he can teleport him and just... Just one-shot me next turn. It's okay. I think I can just drop my nemesis.
I think I want to go down here, just in, just in case some shenaniganry happens. Maybe I even want to protect myself like that. Instead of trading. Just so bullshit teleport, double damage, I don't even know what fucking thing, shenanigans don't get me. Am I getting too paranoid? I'm getting too paranoid. I should make sure I have lethal next turn. And that's how I make sure I have lethal next turn. What I should have done is I should have placed my hero, maybe... There, yeah. I should have placed my hero where the nemesis stands, and the nemesis there, or nemesis like... Mm, then nemesis wouldn't be able to cover me from backstabbing before... Instead of, without dying from the Arkhan. Ah, hard to say, hard to say. A pity win for scrubbing out the first game. Maybe you can you can get a get, get a couple of games off of me, Sharian. You're playing Abyssian, right? I have a bad win rate against Abyssian. And Naga, he's onto something. Aymara is then dead. But that means I've got 21 HP again. And I've got a Dark Nemesis, he's got 6 HP. And I've got two Stars Furies. What do you have? What do you have that will help you right now? Ah, uh, fuck, he's still got this. He's still got- no way, he's still got this. Wow, no, no. Oh my god. Oh my fucking god. He did it. What the fuck, no, no. I mean, I basically get four damage right now. I don't see more than four damage. And he's got a gigantic minion in my face. Oh, calm the fuck on. Replace four. Still four damage. So I, I, I'm not even gonna do it, I think. Fuck! <laughs> God, I'm not even gonna play fast enough. Oh my god, I just lost the game, because I thought too long. I just lost the game. GG. GG. My fault, probably. I don't know. I didn't have the right answer, but I sure as fuck could have played better than this. I think he could figure out some kind of lethal right now. With this gigantic guy with 7 damage. I mean, he's got 10 damage on hand. If he just plays some seals, some backstab... Could... Oh god. What a disaster. What an absolute disaster. I, 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 I was searching for it way too long, that's the problem. I was searching for it way too fucking long. And my punishment is probably gonna be death. Ah, oh, damn it. So with the Star's Fury, I get only two summons, and I can't even kill the Chakri. Oh my god. That is so bad. Okay. Strike four. Cast two. Strike one. Oh, it's exhausted. Fuck. Cast three. I don't got much, I just I just gotta play this. Cast one. 
This is so stupid. Finish turn. This is so stupid. I almost had him. I cannot believe I almost had him and now this situation is happening. Where he can totally just find lethal. And me? I guess I could too. We'll see. We'll see. Could still have my Osiris. Could still have a Rasha's curse. But... Honestly? I cannot believe this is even happening. Basically. I mean, look at my, my hand right now. I don't have removal. If he plays something big, I just can't handle it. I can just totally get overwhelmed, out-muscled. Even with my, with my stuff. This is so bad. I cannot believe he came back from this. So fucking bad. <laughs> Rust crawler. I really needed that stuff, you know? I I really kind of fucking did. Oh shit. Replace one. No time for scarab. I need to kill these things before they get any bigger. Cast 5. I guess Scarab next turn. Unless I take more damage with the hero but play the Scarab now. Might be a worthwhile thing. Might be a worthwhile thing to get the Scarab faster. Cast 1. Strike 4. Or maybe... Strike 8. Home. Home. I think this minimizes the damage to the hero when I don't attack him at all. Finish turn. Cavalry doesn't play a deck, he just pulls from full card pool. <laughs> Very much possible. Very much possible. Yeah, I think I'm gonna get wrecked, but we'll see. We'll see. I got a Scarab, I got Aymara. I think I'm going to just put my hero in a corner and drop Aymara next to me, so that only the Onyx Bear Seal can save him. Anything else, and, and basically he's gonna die just from the effect. A shroud. Well, thank god he didn't use it for Aymara, I guess. That scarab can still be used for trading. And defending myself. And I've got two more scarabs in my deck. Oh, shit! Okay, now it gets worse, because he can heal himself. Now it gets really fucked up. Oh my god, okay, no. No, I'm dying really soon now. Now shit is getting on a completely new level over here. Fuck. What is he doing? Oh, he's not teleporting himself, he's just summoning a minion. <sighs> we'll play still. Decay? I cannot use Decay Aymara, and I really need to use Aymara, so no Decay yet. Probably next turn then. Do I use that Scarab to protect myself or to go after him? I've got 9 HP. I lose. I lose. There's so many things he can do to me right now. Like a double, a double Phoenix Fire. Maybe I shouldn't have traded. Maybe I shouldn't have traded. May I just mention that if I top deck a Rasha's Curse in the last five turns at all, I would have already won and the game wouldn't even exist anymore? Yeah. Fuck this. It's, a, it's, it's, it's probably a very entertaining game to watch, but 
it's so heartbreaking to just be almost there and then and then I just can't get this last one card to kill him. I was it was just two damage short. And now he is pulling all the combos and it's not working for me anymore. This is probably the first time in a very long time I am actually playing long range and losing. But that Rust Crawler just wrecked me so much. I'm not pulling my, my Blast Minions. He silenced my Sky. He just has all the answers and I'm, I'm not having enough. Well, he didn't use his Phoenix Fires and he just needs two Phoenix Fires. There's nothing else. Just two Phoenix Fires and that's it. What? He doesn't have anything in his deck? Does he have a hand full of like six useless cards right now? And that's, is that what's happening? Replace five. What the hell? Um. Um. Cast two. What is he doing? Am I going to actually kill my own Aymara? I think I need to. I think I have to. He doesn't have a way to summon next to me anymore. Cast five. Oh fuck, I can't! I can't kill her! Oh, I lose, I lose. GG. Ah, oh, I cannot even do it! Okay, now he's just gonna top deck his Phoenix fires. Damn it. I need to put myself in the middle so that if I top deck a blasting stuff at least, I can use it. Fuck, he's just gonna kill me with spells, isn't he? And I've been top decking this 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 obelisk like five times now. Instead of my Rasha's curses. Which I have three off, by the way. Unbelievable bullshit this game. <laughs> Unbelievable bullshit. So now he's gonna be... Why didn't he spam up those minions last turn? I don't understand. What would be his reason for not doing that? And he could have a third teleporting spell. Replace six. So my Aymara still has to be next to me. Home. Home. Where the fuck are my Rasha's curses? Dude! I run three, like seriously, I run three! They have n home. 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 I need her to protect me from cast two. Right, I am actually buffing this bastard. More than I'd like. He's just gonna... Yeah, he's just gonna be a badass, what can I say? Should I surround myself so that he can't attack me with the Mantis? Maybe I should. I'm getting paranoid, like really paranoid. I'm getting really paranoid. <laughs> oh my god. I don't even know what to do anymore. I'm one Russia curse. What the fuck? I'm running three. I'm still not getting it. I'm not getting my blasting stuff. Uh, I'm blown away by the by how badly I'm drawing over here. And then he's got lethal with spells and there's nothing I could have done. So fucking retarded. Of course he wins le next turn. I know. I know. That's how it works. I cannot believe my draw. Just cannot believe my draw. Home. It's the worst tournament I ever played in terms of luck, I think. Nah, there were worse. There were probably worse. 
but my god, what is happening? My, my deck was literally designed to kill a guy that is standing like him. And that's exactly what my deck couldn't do. It's, it's just mind-blowing.